Grafter is a software system designed to support users in creating new 3D printed objects by combining elements from multiple parent models. Unlike previous work that focused on decorative objects, Grafter helps users remix objects that perform mechanical functions, such as this test tube centrifuge that could, for example, be used to extract spirulina from aquarium water, or any other machine created from these or similar components. In order to get started, the user identifies a parent machine that offers a crank with a gearbox, a second parent machine capable of redirecting rotary movement, and a third parent model with a test tube holder. The challenge now is to make the mechanical elements from the three parent models work together. There is no particular software support for remixing machines today. However, in our survey, we found that makers remix such machines by manually extracting parts from one parent model and combining them with parts from a different parent model. This approach often puts axles made by one maker into bearings made by another maker, or combines a gear made by one maker with a gear made by a different maker. This part-based reuse approach is problematic, however, as parts from different makers tend to fit poorly, which results in a long series of tweaks and test prints until all parts finally work together. We address this with our interactive system, Grafter, Grafter does two things. First, Grafter largely automates the process of extracting and recombining mechanical elements from 3D printed machines. Second, Grafter enforces a more efficient approach to reuse. It prevents users from extracting individual parts, but instead affords extracting groups of mechanical elements that already work together, such as axles and their bearings, or pairs of gears. We call this mechanism-based remixing. In order to achieve this seamless workflow, Grafter first annotates mechanisms in all parent models. This takes about 23 minutes per model and has to be done only once. The actual remixing then takes about five minutes on average. The effort pays off when any remix model could be 3D printed without further tweaking and work immediately, as was the case for all participants in our user study.